Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Kyle. This is Kyle Plays Games. This is Euro Truck Simulator 2, and there was an update with the game, and uh, I want to let you know right now, I'm kind of disappointed. You know why? Let's go to the world map. We're back at Marseille. Uh, I made it to Porto, but I can't pronounce it, but you can see what it is. I know someone um, in the comment section in the last video told me how to pronounce it, but it is like it's something between uh, the brain and mouth. It is I cannot get it to translate here. So uh, we were there, but now we're brought back to uh, Marseille. Hopefully, I can get another trip back to uh, this island and be able to see it. I am really hoping so because that is a really big screw job. I'm going to let you know right now. All right, let's go ahead and click on the stride button and get this uh, show on the road and see just where the next destination is. Please let it be that island, please. As it loads up, I ask you to please like, share, and subscribe. Or let me know what you think about the video in the comments down below. And if you'd like to watch any of these videos happen live, link is in the description down below for my Twitch channel. Be sure to follow along on Twitch so you do not miss out on when I go live. And of course, I have a channel goal on the channel, and that is to get 300 subscribers on the channel at the time of recording that is the current channel goal and uh if and when that channel goal is reached that will get a dlc pack for this game and help expand the map uh, a little bit more and if we're already we sur surpassed that i um urge you to please be sure to subscribe anyway or at any given moment and uh i'm sure i'm doing something else with the channel also too if i'm already at that channel goal um, okay, so uh, I have really lost where I was what my train of thought was supposed to be. Um, yeah, uh, give me a second here. Let me uh, just regroup here, and uh, yeah, that's what, that's what I'm gonna do. I need to not only wait. Am I, am I tired? Am I tired? What is my uh, okay? My sleep gauge is okay. It's my fuel that's up there, but we can get a uh, new. I'm gonna try to get something for like a. Uh, some kind of job here something to the island that would be awesome just so we can uh, get some more here this would get bring me here a yacht it would bring me there and I could be able to travel some more let's do it let's just go ahead and accept this job and uh, get going with it but like I was gonna say uh, before I lost my train of thought with everything else going on in my head there um, after we get to, to 300 subscribers, um, I'll s I can start switching up the channel goals and get other DLC packs for um, um, other games that you might be interested in that I'm also that I'm currently playing on the channel, or I'll take also suggestions of um, uh, other games to um, add to the channel as well that you want to see me play, and uh, I will see what I can do when it comes to that. Remember, I am gaming on a budget, people, so uh, bear with me if you have uh, certain requests. You know, gotta see how how things go. All right, so we're gonna take the yacht from Mercilly to uh, Cal Calvi. Laugh at my pain at the pronunciation of these uh, French cities, but we're gonna take this one. Drive safe. All right, let's go ahead on out, and if we find a place that will uh, that's a at the fuel station, we're gonna stop there and fill up. Every single time I play this game, I'm always like thrown off because I'm on the right side of the cabin. And I refuse to change it because I got this car in the UK and I know how they drive is on the other side of the road. Now, I know you can modify it, but again, uh, that's the reason why I don't change it is because of the where it was purchased at. When I purchase my next truck, whenever that is, um, it will probably have a uh, you know steering wheel on the left side, so I could be less confused over how to drive this. Every time I play it, it's what happens. Every time, I have to just like switch my my brain over to like the opposite side be like it's okay to drive it like this you know like just get used to it again just get used to it if I played this a lot more often I mean than what I do I mean it, it probably wouldn't be much of an issue it'd be like you know 
wouldn't say second practice, but you know, it would just be uh, more common for me. It's a better thing. Just think of simple terms, Kyle. It'll be a whole lot easier for you when you when you drive and talk at the same time. We do have a fuel stop up ahead, so I'll just take advantage of that. I don't even think I'll have enough funds in order to be able to uh, purchase another truck. I know I, I could probably like do payments, but I'd rather just pay for it flat out. So that's why it'll be a little bit bit before I get a new truck. I'm just gonna pull in here real quick here and fill up. All right, it is uh, 188 for uh, diesel price per liter. See this how much that's gonna be. All right, 285 liters, almost 286 liters at 538 euros. Okay then. All right, let's get to our pickup and let's make some more money here. So pull out in front of a car, no big deal. Put this in the camera correctly. I took the job a little earlier during the day because I know by the time I get on that uh, ferry, it will uh, advance the time quite a bit. Man, I feel really... It, it, I don't feel bad, but man, I, I just can't think of the words right now, but I just don't like the fact that I got screwed over from driving on that island just now. I mean, I know that I'm going to get right back to it, but I was at the island, now I got to go back to it. So you, you, as soon as you bring me to it, you take it away from me, and I'm kind of mad over it, but at the same time, I, I get right back to it, but either way, still don't like it, you know? All right, let's go ahead and pick up this yacht. Go to the freight market. You'd still have this yacht, right? Yeah, you do. Okay, cool. I'll take it. Okay, here we go. Where is the yacht at? Ah, over here. Right here. Okay. I take it I'm not gonna get any help from these guys. They're just gonna stand and chuckle, laugh at my pain with this one. Boy, I am really, I am really lined up for this. Totally not a skew at all. Can I, can I get it right? Can I get it right? All right. It took it. It took it. Sweet. All right, let's go ahead and move this yacht. Let's not damage any of it. I'm surprised this isn't like a, one of those wide load um, trailers. This must be one of those uh, discounted yachts, you know? The one that I would be able to afford. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. I just clip, I just clip and take out like a street light with the, uh, with the yacht. It'll buff out. It'll be fine. I will. I don't really want to deal with the roundabout. And oh, I almost I almost clipped that yield sign. We're fine. Everything's fine. Now, if the um, if the island has narrower roads, this is going to be a problem. So it does say this is 17 hours. It's not going to take that long in this video for me to do that, because that ferry is going to take away probably about 10 or 11 hours out of the out of the drive. I think that's how much it took last time. Do I just see him doubling back now? I really have to keep an eye on the uh, on the sides. Cause that does extend out a bit. And of course, you know, don't tip the whole thing when you hit those hills going, uh, taking a corner. 
Okay, we're heading to the docks where the ferry is at. Wide swing it here. Hello! What up? Completely unfazed. Completely unfazed by the uh, wild truck swinging and uh, giant yacht behind him. Yes, now it's called a giant yacht. It's not big, It's not a small one. Go straight on. Thirty-one miles per hour, speeding a little bit, but it's really not much. Nothing that they're gonna ticket me for. Unless, of course, if I get like a speeding camera, then that's gonna be a problem. I'm just gonna barrel through. Be great if I can stay on the road. I mean, I'm just swinging the uh, swinging the uh, steering wheel left and right. Oh boy, I need to start playing this one a little bit more often. At the truck, let's go ahead and clip that with the with the yacht. Uh... I'm not actually gonna do that. I, I really don't want to mess up the uh, mess up this delivery. I'm just talking about that because I think it's a little a little bit of a wider one, but I could be really wrong. But it just it looks like it based on you know like. Yeah, it's a little wide. It's a little sticking now. Yeah, yeah, I'm right. I'm right here. All right, so we've already done like the little uh, the screenshot thing and the uh, cut scene here. So I'm just gonna move ahead. We're not gonna st stop for this again. I mean, why would I? You know. All right, we're gonna swing and okay, and we, oh, okay, we almost clipped the sign again. Almost Tokyo drifted that one. Did I just sell my AIDS? I think I just sold my AIDS. Okay, this is a bit of a tighter one. I gotta be, be a little more careful. That would have been a uh, very costly spill. We're gonna wide swing this a bit. Can you tell how confident I am with my um, turning ability on these roads? Okay, where am I going here? I'm going over here. Okay, I'll I'll do that. And I'll go ahead and park right here. And let's go ahead and figure out our travel destination. Yeah, 14 hours to get there at a price of 1193 euros. Let's go ahead and embark. And okay, now, let's find a new route. I am at the spot I started at. from uh, Well, I left at at the previous one. Matt, why can't I talk? I can't say the right words I want to say. Now we're at the, this beautiful island here, going the wrong way on the street. That is great, okay. Now it's a two-way road. Don't clip anything. Get ready. Turn right. Turn right. So we're, it's at, it's nine, almost 9.30 at night right now. We still have plenty of daylight, surprisingly. We're three and a half hours away. We're gonna deliver this at midnight, unfortunately. We're not gonna to see too much of the uh, island um, itself during the day. But, you know, we're gonna take what we can get right now because this game really did not give me a whole lot to work with. So I believe, I'm just gonna pause it for a moment here. We are going to go a little bit around the island, but we are going to avoid all of the uh, uh, camera spots. Because I guess that's a... yeah, that doesn't even connect. Eh, okay, I understand that. It's really kind of a one-way, once I... unless if there's a detour here, then we go around the island. We'll get it. We won't even get a camera shot there either. Okay, but we'll, uh, we'll make it to our destination over here in Calvi, the western part of the island.
Wow, it takes three and a half hours to get around this island? That's a... It's, it's de definitely a small island. And that's doable. I mean, that's a less Watch than the, the time take the second exit. it takes to get from uh, Miami to uh, Key West. I mean, uh, in a homestead to uh, Key West. I totally did not break there. I, didn't, I did not give way for anybody. And I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Exit it's okay. No, I'm just a tourist. I'm not from around here. Totally fine, everything's fine. No need to panic over my driving abilities. Kind of getting back to the spot I left at from the last video. If you haven't seen that video, feel free to check it out in the playlist of Euro Truck Simulator. I have all of the videos that I have done there from uh, humble beginnings to the not so humble um, times now even though it is still humble. I just had to say it like that. At the roundabout, take the first exit. Exit now. If I could make the corner, it'd be great. That's a tight turn. Tight corner. So I think my destination was originally to the, uh, was an exit the third exit in this roundabout. At the roundabout, take the first exit. So we're just gonna, I'm just gonna drive over this. All right, there we go. All right. That actually went a lot smoother than what I thought it was going to. I thought it was gonna, I was gonna, that was like hit like a tree or anything, but we're good. 120 miles to go. Now we're in the uh, discovering the new roads territory now, which is pretty cool. You know, okay, this is 50 miles per hour. I can speed it up a bit. That should be pretty easy and going downhill. Just coast it, just coast it for right now. As I hit the accelerator again, because uh, oh, that's that, that's 31. Wow, that dropped significantly. Thank goodness there were no cops around or uh, speed cameras. Why did it drop so so quickly? A scary billboard. Doesn't it seem like that when it comes to like some of the billboards that the uh, especially like the fashion ones or maybe like the uh, cologne stuff or anything like that? It's like like they really put in the uh, the fear of uh, what the models look like. <laughs> Maybe I was just that one. Maybe I'm just talking my ass, out of my ass right now. I don't know, but. Yeah, you're probably gonna be thinking, you know, like, well, okay, what is he on right now? Because that made no sense at all. And you know what, it is true. I'll own up to that. That did not make any sense. But this, maybe it was a set ad that just seemed like, you're like, whoa. And maybe that was the point in order to be able to catch your eye because I'm now talking about it. Anyway, let's move on. Let's try to see if I can uh, navigate these turns. It's starting to get dark now. Okay. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. I am so stupid. Okay, okay. Pause, pause for a quick second here. So when I said that it was currently 9.30 um, at night, I was reading what time it, it would be when we reach the destination. Wow. Um, feel free to roast me in the comments because I cannot read which one the time is. I realize now it is not that time. It is um, 18.59 heading towards 1900.00. It's at 7 p.m., not 9.30 at night. I was kind of wondering why it's 9.30 at night and it's still daylight, but uh, yeah, I totally read that completely wrong. I own up to it. Can we please move on? That was so bad. That was really bad. All right, so it is, all right, I need to put my lights on. What are my lights again? These are my lights. Okay, these are my lights. Lights are on. It's 7.02, uh, 7.03, and it's, it's 7 p.m. at night. Um, we're gonna get there 
at 9.30. My goodness, I have not played this game in a, in a bit of time. And I forgot which one is the accurate time, which one is the real time, and which one is the arrival time. At least I know how to read the 24-hour uh, clock, and st you know, at least that's still with me. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe I did that. Probably not the first time in the entire truck simulator series. I've sort of done it before in American Truck, and I'm like, why is that clock not moving for me? I probably, I messed it up too, probably on that on the dashboard itself, thinking it's something completely different. Wow. All right. At least I have the lights on now. I'm not going to get hit with a uh, with the light fine, um, with the you know the headlight violation. It looks like it might start raining, or that's just the, the cloud cover, and it's just going to be cloudy, which that'll be fine, you know. Like I don't want to end up hearing all the rain effects, but. Oh well. Get ready to turn left. All right, we are heading into a city here, which a uh, little or town, as to say, Al Alleria, Alleria. Aluria? I know someone's gonna let me know in the comments. Let me know uh, that I'm totally butchering it or I completely got it right. Wow, that's a short light. Turn left. Just rear end the uh, car just because. Well, anyway, hope you guys are enjoying the video so far and laughing at my uh, absolute stupidity of logic. Um, and if you are, be sure to leave a like on the video, share the video, and uh, do not forget to subscribe. And remember, at the time of recording, the current channel goal is 300 subscribers. And if or when we end up doing up reaching that goal, I will in turn. Are, are you going to turn? You're not going to turn. Okay, all right. That makes no sense, but fine. I will take it. Um, I will get a DLC pack for this game and help expand the map a little bit more. And um, if I'm already at or surpassed that uh, channel goal, or any of the other channel goals for that matter, be sure to subscribe anyway. I'm sure I'm doing something with the uh, subscriber count for a goal. And um, you can help uh, that, you know, me reach the next goal uh, just by clicking on that subscribe button. If you also have a suggestion on a DLC pack to end up getting after the uh, 300 um, subscriber count, um, I'm I'm all ears to hear. Like if you want me to add something to uh, another game, and um, I'll look into it, see what I can do. I cannot drive on these winding bends. I am so glad I am not driving super fast. I would have not been able to make it. That would have been really bad. Just ease it in there, ease it in. But anyway, I can't stress it enough. Headlight uses, well, I, my headlights are on. No, they weren't, they were not on. My driving lights are on, the headlights were not on. Everything's going smoothly for me today. All right, break, 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 slow down, slow down, just slow it down. I am so glad that, you know, that people behind me were keeping an eye on me because uh, that would have been a rear end for sure. So the would be fine, but I mean like that, that's an ambulance behind me on there. Well, at least it's an ambulance, you know, they can be able to treat themselves. Okay, another bend, another bend. I'm taking this one slow, I'm taking it slow. Yeah, there's no way I would be able to, to take this at 50. No way. No possible way. I'm sure someone else driving will probably be like, ah, it's super easy. Just go ahead, just go ahead take the clutch and the e-brake and just go, ahead, just go ahead and just turn them on and just turn the wheel, crank it, 
you go two wheels and then you'll be able to drift right on into that thing all while carrying the, uh, the gigantic trailer in the back there might tip it might not tip it but you know what makes for some good makes it for some good driving that's what someone else will probably be saying on there. I'm just saying I'm just going to take it slow. Exit now. While I go completely like not even yielding for traffic on the roundabout. A little under an hour and a half left. Arrival time is now at 10 p.m. Let's begin the um, the evening sun. This is a total like you know um, blackout type of uh, delivery. I remember I used to do those all the time, and uh, someone told me not to do that. One because you couldn't see anything, which I understand totally. I was messing that up completely. Um, but also there was saying for like the realism that truckers don't typically drive at night. They would drive during the during the early morning hours uh, and then continue on. In which, yeah, um, again, that goes into the fact of like I just like with us going from you know like delivery to delivery, not really um, thinking about the time. This was kind of in between there because I wanted to start early to be able to see most of the. Uh, uh, of the island during the day, but yeah, because the ferry took a little longer than it, it took a lot longer than uh, I thought it was going to. We're kind of getting the, the end of the day part of the trip. An hour left. Hour left. Am I going to be able to discover the city, or am I just going to be on the outskirts? I don't even. I'm not even going to try to say that city. Yeah, not even. Not even going to attempt it. Oh, yeah, I did discover it. Sweet. All around the Isle of Beauty. Exit Two out of now. six. So I think we're I think I'm past the middle part of the island and now I'm heading north, I think. It's gotta be something to navigate so let me so let me know besides that TPS lets me know where I'm heading to. But I think I'm just heading to the northern part of the island now. And more winding roads to deal with. Again, I'm going to take this one cautiously slow. Not too slow to the point where I'm fighting the engine, but definitely do not want to uh, go off course, especially on these uh, Second turns here, like this one, off of another. Look at this, look at that bend. I don't know how professional truckers do it. I don't know how. I mean, obviously I did that, but I definitely did not do that. Um, that wait, did I do that at 30 miles per hour? I'm like literally, like looking down at the lane just to make sure I stay in line, and I'm not even keeping track of the speedometer. Because I could be a little bit closer to the uh, edge of the road here. Okay, some more bends coming up here. It looks like it's going to be all bends until we get to the end. About a half an hour out. It's a long winding road. That's all we gotta deal with here. And yes, it is. It is probably d too dark. Here. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, all right. Well, this is new. Right, well, good thing I uh, saw ya. All right, everything's good. That's a very dangerous spot to be pulled over at. It's a good thing I was driving slow, otherwise that would have been a re I would have rear-ended that cop. That is a tight corner too. Again, doing this a little more costly. Like 
like we're doing we're doing some tight corners here, so I'm just ah oh man. This reminds me of that road. I think it was in Switzerland. I think it was that I just totally like went off course and like hit all the guardrails. But that was like so much whining, just like that one one was. I think it was even worse. I mean, I was doing with rain and guardrails on both sides. I mean, the guardrails kept me on the road, but it was just like disastrous, really. I mean, some of you guys want to see me crash. Other other people want to want to see me actually succeed with this. I want to aim with you know driving you know my absolute best I can. Turn, right, turn left. It's a yield. I'm going to yield. I'm going to slow my way into here. And no, there is a car. There is a car. But I'm going to keep on going. We're committed. Everything's fine. Everything is fine. We made it to Calvi. Can I just turn left? Because then you'd be driving into the <laughs> to oncoming traffic, Kyle. Oh, that's, t that's a tight one. That's a tight one. We're fine, though. Right. Alright, we turn right, and then literally it's at the end of the road. Turn right. Alright. Unfortunately, we don't get to see the beauty of uh, this coast because we're arriving, you know, we at 10:19. But we're gonna do the whole "Where do you need it at?" That's a tight one too. Here, what's the what's this one here? Oh, that seems like it's even harder. That would actually seem like it's harder. But let's go ahead and take this, and I'm gonna. Yeah. Okay. All right, all right. Um, <laughs> I don't have much room there, so I'm gonna turn this way. Probably wrong for doing this. Probably totally wrong. Um, is it this way? No, no, not that way. Not that way. Cut the wheels the other way, Kyle. Cut like this. Trying to balance it out, really trying to balance it here. Okay, all right. Almost, per almost, almost. That was that was really close, I will say. It's not perfect. That's why I have to readjust. Give myself some more room. Actually, you no, know, I need to cut it this way, right? Nope, no, not other way. Other way. I'm always gonna get that confused. I always will. And I need to slow it down a bit. Slow it down. Okay, I cut the wheels too much. I made it worse. I made it worse. Okay, why am I doing this to myself? Why am I doing this to myself? I ask you this. Why am I messing up my... Why? I'm overthinking it. That's all I'm doing. I'm thinking too much. 
and which I need to stop thinking so much and just do it, you know? Just keep on going, just let it fall right into the water, that'd be perfect with it. I know it says it's good, but I don't like this. It, looks, it seems like I would not get the parking bonus for that one. Okay, this? This seems promising. Okay, don't drive off. Don't drive off. I'm so gonna make myself late because I'm just trying to be a perfectionist on it and I need to stop. Okay, here we go, here we go. Ease in, ease in. And oh, look at that, okay. We're gonna pretend like that was the first try. Yeah, we're gonna pretend like this is the first try. Drop it down and get paid. Nobody saw the fact it took me like 10 different, you know, tries to be able to uh, position that in the same spot that I was pos positioning in it in the entire time. But uh, nonetheless, we're in Calvi now. And uh, finally made it back to the island after that update with the game. Unfortunately, you know, that it just, how it goes, I'm lucky enough that uh, it gave me a delivery immediately, uh, bringing me back to the island. So uh, all in all, we're, you know, got some more cities discovered and uh, we got to see a nice tour of the island. Unfortunately, it's during the evening, but you know, well, let's take what I can get right now. I just really wanted to fast, fast track back to the island. So we got a total of 8,655 euros pocketed, um, minus about 300 for that speeding fine. Was, was it 300? I, it was probably a lot more than that. I mean, not speeding fine. The light, the light fine. It was a fine, okay? Like, it was a fine that I did not think I should have deserved because I thought I had my lights on, okay? Experience, 393 experience. Not a whole lot because it was a smaller trip, but we're going to get the longer trips eventually. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, leave a like on the video. If you were laughing at my pain and, or my stupidity of me saying some random dumb stuff that I should have known better than saying, be sure to leave a like anyway and uh, subscribe to the channel as well. Remember, like I said during the video, current channel goal at time of recording is 300 subscribers. And if or when we reach that channel goal, I will get a DLC pack for a Euro Truck Simulator 2 and help expand the map out a little bit more. And if I'm already uh, surpassed that uh, subscriber count by the time you discover the channel or feel like subscribing, I mean, feel free to subscribe anyway. I'm sorry I'm doing something with a subscriber count at, with any type of goal at any given moment. And uh, also, um, leave a comment um, letting me know like if you uh, want me to get other DLC uh, content for other games I'm currently doing or if you have suggestions for uh, games on the channel uh, I'm all ears to hear what, what you uh, might be interested in uh, watching me play and I'll see what I can do with, to make uh, some of that stuff happen uh, but bear with me like I said gaming on a budget um, okay so I've already got the likes here and subscribe and comment I lost track of what I was saying it's late um, if you'd like to watch any of these videos happen live, link is in the description down below for my Twitch channel. Be sure to follow along on Twitch so you do not miss out on when I go live. There you go, I got through the outro. <laughs> With only a few stutters and, and uh, hiccups along the way. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.